Need an interface? Choose the pre's the pros use. Focusrite. No gimmicks. Just 25 years of mic pre excellence. We're here on the Alesis booth where um, Eric McGregor has escaped from his duties on the Akai side of the establishment to show us the new ProTrack, which is a way of turning your iPhone or your uh, iPod Touch into a flash recorder. Exactly. Actually, all you need to do with our ProTrack, you have a sled that will hold your iPod or your iTouch or your iPhone even in place. If you're using an iTouch or an iPhone, you can actually utilize the BIOS application iPro Recorder. This basically turns an iPod or an iPhone or an iTouch into a hard drive with microphones on it. You're using uh, stereo condenser mics on the top of this. You've got your adjustment knobs in the front here. You have a built-in limiter. You can charge your iPod. You can even send phantom power out the two combination XLR quarter inch jacks on the bottom of the unit to external microphones if you want to get that way. Again, you've got a uh, built-in limiter. You can go stereo to monitor. You've got your headphone monitoring off the bottom of it, power supply on the side. Again, using the BIOS iPro recorder software, you can then utilize an iTouch or an iPhone to record direct wave files onto your iTouch iPhone. If you're just using a regular iPod, it utilizes the voice memo function on there. It's still a wave file, so basically you'll have a date and time stamp file of all the recordings that you've made. This is great because most iPods have at least 40 gig capacity on it, which means you've got a very large capacity for recording, whether you're in a situation like this, conducting interviews at a live show, or just simply in your rehearsal studio putting ideas together. You'll have everything saved on your iPod. You can transfer it to iTunes. And again, it's not an MP3 or protected file. It's a WAV file date and time stamped on your iPhone, your iTouch, or your iPod. This is the ProTrack, Matt Price of $199, now available from Elisa. Thanks, Eric. That looks very appetizing. Thank you, Bob. Yes.